BYOB. Be your own bank. Or be your own broker. We live in a world where, for the most part, everything is done through middlemen. Even in real estate. Yes, I am coming at my own neck. Whether in real estate, buying a house, selling a house, buying stocks through online brokerage accounts, buying bonds, financial advisors. For the most part, if you look at how the system is set up today, everything is done through brokers. Everything is done through middlemen. This is the old financial system. The future financial system is everyone will be their own bank. Or you'll have the option to be your own bank. There will be services for those who can't handle it or don't want to handle it or have too much money to handle it. And that's where the same players like uh, Fidelity and Charles Schwab, they'll come in. But the option to be your own bank, be your own broker, that is the future of finance. Digital wallets, where everyone will have a digital, wa digital wallet on their phone, is the future. You will transact on your phone in the future. It's crazy to think about it, but it's not so crazy when you're doing the research, when you're doing the homework, when you're paying attention to what's going on around you. These folks are, there are people in power with lots of money who are thinking, not just a year ahead, not five years ahead, not 10 years ahead. They're thinking 20, 50, 100 years ahead from now. If you look at the World Economic Forum, and the World Economic Forum is the major players who's talking about the Great Reset, who during COVID had all these ideas about the Fourth Industrial Revolution. These folks. When you look at that guy, Charles Schwab, that man, he started making moves regarding the World Economic Forum and putting things into place for where they are today. He started, this man started in 1970s it's 2022 we're talking literally 50 years earlier from where we're at this man was putting small things into place to get us where we're at today and where we're going to be at in five ten years listen i don't make these videos because i'm bored i don't make these videos because i'm looking for a million subscribers i make these videos because i truly care and initially it was just about really caring about black men and I still do care about black men at the same time especially living in the hood being in the Bronx walking around with a suit all day I realized that I gotta look out for black men more than I gotta look out for the cops or white men or Latino men now if I was in LA in the hood that'd probably be a little different cause you know it'd be the Latino men that'd be trying to body you out there but as of right now, where I'm at is, is black men that I gotta mainly look out, mainly look out for. In terms of my safety and my health. And I understand at this point, I would be foolish just to think about only black men. Because what's coming is coming for everybody. And it doesn't matter if you're white or you're Asian or you're Latino or whatever you are, Caribbean. If you're not on the right side of things, you're gonna miss out. And I believe that the future, you're gonna have wealthy people who are, are, are of all races hanging out, networking, and building together. And in the poor side, you're gonna have all races of people living together, going through the slums together. Because if you're not aware of what the fourth industrial revolution is, if you're not aware of how we are edging towards a digital economy, if you don't understand how the rich literally control most of the assets around the world, and what that means for us on the lower ends of society because we were never taught to accumulate assets. We were taught to accumulate college degrees. We were taught to accumulate college debt. We were taught to accumulate uh, single family houses to think that we are a part of the American dream. And it was really the American nightmare because we've been taught nonsense. 
and now we see that all the nonsense we've been taught over the last 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 years is coming home to an end, to where they're ending all of that nonsense. And they're bringing forth a new system, a new digital system, where you can make millions from anywhere from your laptop or your phone. And if you have the mindset of, I'm gonna go to college and hopefully come out and somebody's gonna pay me a decent salary, you will get left behind. Please study and understand what it means to be your own bank. Please understand crypto. Understand tokenization of assets. Please understand what the fuck is going on right now. Because I don't want to see you left behind. I don't even know you. Because I know there's going to be so many people left behind in this new system. I know there's going to be so many people that don't know what is going on. I look at all these old people who it probably took them a decade or in a half a half decade or a full decade to understand computers. My grandmother just got hit to YouTube maybe two, three years ago. And she still gets most of her information from the news. The news channel is always on. And I know just for her, it's the same for millions of others across the, across the globe. America too, but across the globe. At least other countries, they kind of warn one another. At least other countries, they kind of understand like, yo, they've been printing and reprinting this, this worthless piece of paper continually. So I gotta do something. I gotta take a risk on something. On gold or silver or crypto. I gotta do something. In America, we're just being cooked alive and we don't even realize it. And that's why I just know that one, two, three decades, this is the place to be. People, we were losing it when gas was four fifty, five dollars, six dollars. I'll leave it at that. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and uh, you know, God bless you all. Stay tuned. Stay knowledgeable. Keep keep searching. Keep digging, cause the the well goes deep. I'll catch you on the next one. Later.